What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. For those of you that follow the channel, you know we do a whole bunch of headphones, earphones, reviews, comparisons, and our most recent one that we did our unboxing with is these new OnePlus Buds Pro. They have been phenomenal that we've been using now for a little while. You can see just how good they look. Obviously typical inspiration from the AirPods as all these other manufacturers are doing but with a slight twist as well as somewhat of a unique design. So as you can see here those buds come in black or white with that matte color and that stem. These are by no means premium feeling. They do feel pretty plasticky but feel good in your ears. I've had no issues wearing these now for a little while and the noise cancellation is good for the price point. It does the job pretty well. They connect seamlessly even if you're not using a OnePlus device. If you use one of their headphones without a OnePlus phone, you have to use one of these other apps that I will show you right here. That is what you're going to use for that experience. So, what you do, you tap to connect, it'll automatically realize they are connected and you can see it right there. Let me go ahead and open this up for you guys. Reconnect. And it'll take just one second. Maybe. Okay. So, here's the app in full as you can see. You have your different noise cancellation modes, whether you want uh, it active, off, or full transparency mode so you can hear the sound around you as well. I tend to leave noise cancellation on. It was on obviously as you saw when I just connected uh, and it worked good. It's very hard to hear your own voice but it is not as solid as a closure as something like the AirPods Pro or especially not the AirPods Pro Max or excuse me the AirPods Max. So having said that the app is good. The most important aspect here I'll show you is to do your own sound ID profile that you like. It's running it as we are speaking. Um, this is going to allow you to adjust your sound. So this audio ID really helps customize it and give it more of a rich sound. Um, again, you have to use this app just to get that. And I'm gonna scroll through it really quick and tell you it's called the Hey Melody app. So keep that in mind as well. Beyond that, the fit over time uh, is not a factor. I use the Pixel Buds and the Pixel Bud A series for a while and they definitely give you ear fatigue. These not so much at all. They really just feel well and keep your ears somewhat relaxed and not very uh, fatigued like I said. So having said that, for that reason alone, as well as the Nothing One Plus, or excuse me, the Nothing Ear Ones that we've reviewed. These are definitely high up there in regards to the comparison that's going to be coming soon as well. Uh, personally, for the $50 difference in price point, I would take my chance with that Nothing Ear Ones if you can get them. Um, you're just not a true backing for the company yet. You don't know what's going to happen if you're, you have an issue with the phone, or excuse me, with your earphones and they break. Uh, what is that support going to look like? What is the um, turnaround time to get that returned? What's the turnaround time to get a uh, either, either your reimbursement for it or a exchange for a new device? These are the questions you don't know for that company yet. But it's backed by you know one of the founders from OnePlus, so it's very likely he knows what he's doing. He knows how to build up hype for his products. This is just the start of what they're going to release um, with those Nothing Year Ones. So. Having said that, if you're more comfortable with an established brand, you're paying a little more, getting a similar feature set, uh, and similar battery life as well for that. Beyond these couple of callouts, uh, battery life has been great. The case will recharge them, like I said, for a little while. Um, a couple go around, so I use these on a flight, actually from Florida to Maine. No issues there at all. It worked out very well. I did bring my Nothing Year Ones. A plane is one of the best tests for noise cancellation just for the simple fact of how loud it is. Nothing matched what the AirPod Pros did. I'm just throwing that out there now. However, the um, OnePlus Buds Pro and the Nothing Ear Ones did better personally to me than what happened with the Beats Studio Buds that I used as well. Um, 
I'm not sure if the seal just isn't right or they just didn't fit right for me personally. I can use one of the other ear tips, but this by no means was a slouch for that price point that they're selling them at. Um, beyond that, no complaints. Uh, works with Android, iOS devices. It's simply a Bluetooth connection uh, using Bluetooth 5. So keep that in mind as well. Beyond that, what other comparisons were you guys like to see for these OnePlus Buds? Uh, we can do the Pros, like I said, the AirPod Pros. We can do those Nothing Year Ones. That's actually in the works. The Beat Studio Buds. We got them all in addition to a ton of other ones uh, from Soul, even from OnePlus. Let us know. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.